Friday Night Frenzy, sponsored by Berkshire Heating and Air and Wilbur Hammond, Munson Academy. Good evening, sports fans. It's time. Favorite day of the week. It's Friday Night Frenzy. I'm your host, Glenn Kittle, and we've got a lot of highlights here for tonight, but let's not talk anymore. Let's roll right into them. We've got Chicken Pea Pacers hosting Commerce in Zot Park. Kick things off in the first quarter. Quarterback Braden Siano is going to roll left and pass to Eliza Sanchez. He's getting in there for a big game. Makes one miss before going out of bounds. A few plays later, Siano hands off to Xavion Maldonado. Maldonado breaks to the outside, takes one man on and rolls into the end zone. Touchdown, makes it 7-0 for the Pacers. Commerce going to get on offense here. They're driving. This time it's a bad snap. Chicken Peas Hector, Hector Adorno recovers the ball. Getting them back on the ball. Later in the corner, Commerce punts. Chicken Pea player is going to touch it. The ball is going to be recovered by Commerce, putting them in great field positioning. Commerce going to pick things up on the goal line for them. Quarterback drops back. It's tipped and intercepted by Chicopee's Xavion Maldonado. He's getting it done on both ends tonight. Now let's take things on over to the second quarter after he takes it back for a decent game for them. Commerce now has the ball on the goal line. Nathaniel Chacon hands off to Julio Ramos. Busted in for the touchdown. Commerce misses the point after a 10, makes it 7-6. Chicopee and the final score in that one, Commerce taking the W. 26-15 over Chicopee. South Hadley showing off their new helmets. Colts, not impressed. First quarter, Colts quarterback Calvin Kagan hands off to Josiah Feliz and Feliz Navidad, baby. He's going to pick up the first down and then some. Colts now finding themselves in the red zone early on in this one. A few plays later, hands off to Josiah Feliz again. He's in for the touchdown. Feliz, he's happy in Spanish, and he sure is happy about that one. Second quarter, South Hadley with the ball at the 20. Tigers, Owen Dawson takes the handoff and gets through the crowd and in for the Tigers touchdown. Tigers take the 8-7 lead after a nice little two-point conversion. Colts back on the ball. Colts pass is tipped, and it's Owen Dawson again. This time, coming up with the interception. Tigers with the ball with 12 seconds before the half. Gets taken down for a nice game there. Tigers, Burke, Belsky. Tosses it up to who else but Owen Dawson. Dawson with the pass, and Julius Henda comes up with the ball. South Hadley's touchdown. In the past three out of the four plays, Dawson has a receiving touchdown, interception, and a passing touchdown. Third quarter, handoff goes to Shane Upham in for the touchdown. But this one is going to be a final score. South Hadley going to end this one with a W. 28-19 over Comp. Now we're going to go up to the undefeated Amherst Hurricanes, visiting the winless Holyoke Purple Knights. Jameson Dion is going to be picking up where he left off last week. Toss to the outside, and he's putting on the wheels, taking it down to the two-yard line for a 40-yard run. They say Crazy is trying the same thing over and over again and expecting different results. Good thing the Hurricanes are completely in their right mind. Hand off to Dion and put six on the board. It's simple as that. Amherst is going to be going back on offense. They put a man in motion. And who else to score on this one but Jameson Dion? Getting it to the outside, following his blockers. But he's going to be taken down right at the goal line, missing out on six on this play. Now, I know what you're thinking. Now, just hand it to Jameson Dion. Nope. Amherst spreading the love. This time, it's Matt Hockman cutting up the middle, and he's in for an aggressive five-yard touchdown. Holyo, we're going to get something going here in this game. Quarterback Nathan Pock in the pocket. He's a downfield into triple coverage, and it's going to be the little guy. Taylor Alfaro Leva picks off the Purple Knights. And the good times keep on rolling for the Hurricanes. Final score in this one, Amherst 58, Holyoke. Or excuse me, Amherst 54, Holyoke 8. Ball Metal Lancer is taking a short road trip to face off against the West Side Terriers. Picking up in the first quarter, Terriers quarterback Nathan Stone. Finds Noah Cunningham for a first down and then some. Terriers making the most of their first possession of the game. West Side going to be moving into the red zone. Now this time it's the handoff to Johnny Gingerua. Breaks it up to the outside, puts a mean stiff arm on the defender. Gets over the goal line. West side touchdown, puts the points on the board for them. West side going for two, and they fake the handoff, and Nate Stone finds Caleb Bradley on the curl route. West side making it eight to nothing in the first quarter. West side find themselves back in the red zone after a three and out. The throws to Brandon Paquette, who can't hold on to it, and Chris Lapone. He's going to recover for the Lancers. Final play of the half, Dinder Ruak, quarterback, he's got time. Steps up in the pocket, looking for his man and finds Caleb Bradley. 
taking the elevator all the way up to the top floor and coming down with the toe tap to make it 14-0 Westside at West Springfield. Taking the W over Longmeadow 35-20.